Would-be vice presidential candidate Mike Huckabee was in Israel visiting the beleaguered town of Sderot. INN TV's correspondent Tennis Samuel was there. While the nomination for Republican presidential candidate has been all but decided, the coveted position of vice president remains open. As part of that race, one-time presidential candidate Governor Mike Huckabee traveled to Israel in an effort to drum up support for his party's number two slot. While visiting the Jewish state, Huckabee made a trip to the battered city of Sterot, where he was appraised of the situation by local authorities. And now every child knows in Sterot that since the disengagement, they have no control. They decide when there'll be a ceasefire and when uh, the rackets will uh, trickle down. I spent three days and three nights here just a few uh, months ago with Alon Davidi, my good friend and Rabbi Findel. Mm -hmm. I, ha I had to run from those missiles. I heard that Seva Edom on Shabbos at 4.30 and saw everybody running. This is not normal. Part of the aim of terror is to, they know no hours, and they make this place when a city can't fall, when hundreds of businesses close, when property becomes valueless, when uh, terror strikes throughout an entire community. That's the beginning of a downfall of the city. Okay. Actually went through into a guy just in front of his nose. This is, this is a new... He was too late to run, so he decided to stay and pray. And the struggle just missed him by the nose. Terrorism at its worst causes people to change their ordinary behaviors that they would uh, engage in uh, during uh, a normal life. And there's nothing normal about waking up every day thinking that a rocket might come through your roof. Among the organizers of the trip and attendees at Sterot was New York Assemblyman Dove Heikind, who, while a Democrat, supported Huckabee's presidential run and now supports the governor for the vice presidential post. Governor Huckabee uh, is one of the greatest friends that Israel has in America. Our heart and soul is the same, and that is we love Israel and we want Israel to be secure and we want Israel to live in reality, not make-believe. Following the presentation of the situation in the city, Mike Huckabee reiterated his position that an Arab state should not be created on the lands of Yesha. We know you can have two families, two cultures that can live near each other, but the reality is that having two different sovereign governments trying to oversee the same piece of real estate is uh, at best impractical and at worst irrational. During the visit, Huckabee gave a defense of the presumptive Republican candidate, arguing why Jews should support John McCain over his Democratic opponent. John McCain understands that terrorism is a very real threat in a very dangerous world, and he has simply had more experience, and I think his judgment would be uh, centered on that experience. He clearly recognizes the uh, amazing threat that Iran poses not only to Israel, but to the civilized world. 